Hey, what's up TMD crew? It's another video and this is the long awaited Bandai 1 to 5000 scale LED limited edition lighting model. Um, yeah, as you can probably hear from my voice, um, <laughs> I'm not too happy. Basically guys, uh, and this is going to my customers out there, the TMD crew is that I had major problems uh, yesterday and I'm just making this short little um, explanation and to say I'm very sorry on what happened um, so what happened was basically a few months ago uh, I actually put in an order for some of these kits and I was promised a good batch full of these um, Star Destroyers and uh, Went to pay from yesterday and lo and behold, um, when I went into pay for my order, uh, the guy was like, uh, well, we don't have you on the system. So I'm like, are you joking? I've got like 60 odd customers that want these kits. And yeah, that's what happened. Um, they didn't have the order for me. So I've basically had to spend the last two days and I'm still continuing on refunding people and having to contact people on if they want to pay a little bit extra for one of these shop bought ones. I did manage to pick up 10 today, which has obviously um, helped a few people out, uh, my customers. And like I said, guys, for the people that ordered from me, I do apologize. This has been the biggest stress for me ever. This is the first time something big's happened within my uh, my own little business. And um, big shout going out to Steve the Fish. Steve, uh, Greg, if you're watching, uh, no doubt you will be. Um, I'll have to contact you later. But basically, I had to carry these kits, 10 kits, on the train today and to my house. It was just insane. But anyway... Um, let's get on to the positive side of this kit as you can see this box is friggin huge by the way if I can measure the box so for you guys that uh, have ordered it I think you're gonna be paying over the odds for shipping sadly it's 59 centimeters uh, in length and the width is 40 so that straight away is 90 and that's not including the uh, the breadth so it looks like it's going to be uh, an expensive shipping arrangement for you guys. But uh, beautiful box art, big huge thing um, showing the uh, back of the destroyer. Also in the corner, if we can show you here, uh, it's got a small picture of the uh, little uh, LED unit, which I'm not a big fan of. Side of the box, it's got some blurb. Um, got some side views, got some uh, shots of the actual uh, LED and stuff on there. Uh, and I'm not going to show you the, the sides because it's, it's nothing too interesting. But on the other side, showing you some of the... Oh, wow, I didn't know that. It's actually got a, a blockade runner on there and the Millennium Falcon. And this is a bit of a strange scaling, actually. Um, but uh, what you get in the box is your sprues. It's got some stuff um, from Seiji Takashi, which I know that guy, actually. Um, and they also have a picture of the other version, which I could get, which I can get. And basically today when I was shopping, Yodabashi camera had sold out. Ami Ami and Yellow Submarine had lots of these kits in, so it's probably due to the pricing and stuff. Here's what you're gonna see guys. Um let me uh put the camera down a little bit. You've got this bag here. Now what is before me is just immense uh and if you can see the detail on that but it is incredible 
So it's going to be a, a long project for some of you guys. Um, this is obviously the uh, underside, I think. You know, you can you can see the the details. Uh, I don't want to undo the bag because this is for a customer. Um, but yeah, you won't be disappointed at all. Um, I think it's more detailed than the actual PG Bandai kit. Um, really intricate. Um, so my advice for you guys that are, are going to buy this is that when you do come a prime it and stuff like that, yeah, make sure that you thin your primer down um, because it's so detailed. You don't want to. I mean, I don't know if you could, how well you can see that on there, but that is pretty mad to say the least. I haven't seen the Zvezda one. Um, uh, this is this is a very short video, but. Uh, yeah, you won't be disappointed in uh, buying this kit. It's so detailed. As much as I complain about Bandai, I mean, this is pretty phenomenal. I think I, I think like for actual casting and details, this is one of the best ones that they've made. That's for your back unit, your thrusters and stuff. Now we get to the main section. Uh, this has been sellotaped down onto some cardboard, but yeah, it's uh, for you guys that are going to be panel washing. Good lord, good luck with that, because it's just like a trillion fucking panels on here. But uh, I know some of you guys want to see what the uh, length is. The length is 32 centimeters from nose tip to the back tip, just to give you some scaling. We got some thrusters here, D2 screw, screw, marked with Bandai Spirits Japan. As you know, they've changed their, uh, their division. And this is a clear part. I presume that's for some. Is it lighting or something? I don't know. Don't know why that's clear. Like I said, I'm not a Star Wars builder, so I have very basic knowledge. Now, this is the infamous uh, LED box. I'm not sure where this is going to be positioned on the kit till I look at the instructions, but you seem to have four switches there. And oh, sorry, is that four? Five, sorry. Two are in grey, and the other three are in black. And they are, I don't know, there's like three mil, two mil LEDs. Oh, I beg your pardon, there's actually some more sockets there. I was going to say, that doesn't seem enough, but we need to uh, have a closer inspection, guys. And like I said, for the guys that are watching this that I had to refund, I am going to be sorting something out where if you come back and order from me, just send me a message and I'll give you some discount on some, on, on your next orders and stuff. Now, this is the... What sprue is that? that is, it's all clear parts. I know that. C sprue. These are all clear i presume that maybe i don't know maybe this fits internally so the light comes through easier i'm not quite sure but if you look closely they are very very small like holes for the light to come through and if you can see that there but there is a lot and i don't know how they did that on the machining but that is pretty intense. Uh, this is the stand. I'm not quite sure what that is. You've got your other section there. The, uh, the underneath, or is it the top? I'm, I'm not sure. A-spirit might be the top. 
this one's in a plastic bag. Very odd. Why is the other one in there? Now... Oh, there's a little message here. To customer, since this product has extremely precise details subjected, there are some differences in surface deal in the manufacturing process. Okay. No wonder. You get these... Um, Oh, it's a little guidebook in here, guys. Let me just shove this to the side very carefully. You get the uh, instruction manual. Let me uh, dive in. I'm probably the first person in Japan, maybe, so far to actually review this. So Let's see. Open instructions. A part B part PS. Oh, these parts you don't need. Uh, LED installation. Uh, it's got batteries. Takes two double A's, I think. Uh, no, sorry, 